In this series, I only get one biome, with each episode taking me to a different biome than the last. I have 10 days in each one before I am swept away with only what I can keep in my inventory. I have to establish a home, find food, and gather as many resources as I can while on the journey to beat the game. This is episode 4. In the last episode, I lost my villager, built an awesome cottage home, enchanted my diamond gear, and raided a woodland mansion. Now I'm here. Oh, okay, this place isn't too bad. At least the boat works here. But how am I supposed to coexist with that thing? Wait, do we actually, no. Are you kidding me? So I legitimately have to sit in this circle with a guardian temple for the next 10 days. Oh boys, you guys are, you guys are gonna be floating in the water for a while. I forgot I don't have any dirt. Oh boy. Okay, we're gonna get to the opposite side all the way over here. We're gonna drag our chickens along because we are not getting mining fatigue. That is something I do not want to have. Is there any dirt anywhere? I, I don't see any on the ocean floor. I probably should have gathered some of that beforehand. Um, this is so much worse than I thought, actually. I have nowhere to grow crops. I can't really make a base. I can't grow any trees here. I have to rely on the stuff that I already have. Thankfully, we brought some spruce along. All right, well, I guess the first thing I have to do is, oh, I don't even know. We have a one grass block. That's really gonna help us out. Oh, I don't even know what to do. First things first, we're gonna make a crafting table, put it on this kelp right here, and then make a fence. Okay, this should be high enough. All right, that is not high enough. Can I still attach the chickens to it? Perfect. All right, you're gonna get off this, and you're gonna be attached to here. I don't think I'm gonna be able to breed them. So this is gonna be their home for the next 10 days, and, and this is mine, I guess. Oh, I'm not looking forward to that. All right, instead of being frantic and worrying about that the entire time, I know at some point I'm gonna get mining fatigue. I can literally see the guardian. It was right there. And I know in the middle of the freaking ocean, I am not gonna get any cows. I have squids, I have fish, but what we have underneath is the good stuff, all right? I have to find a cave that I can use to mine in. Wait, I actually see something right here. If it's possible, I would like to be able to make some sort of underground base here or underwater base, I guess. We can maybe make some sort of tunnel system. I really don't know how this is gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna drown. Oh, this is not good. I did not think through my options. Oh boy, please get back to the surface quickly. Oh, okay, we resurfaced in time. Um, I'm gonna have to really worry about that, aren't I? I'm at a loss for words. I didn't think I'd be in the ocean this quickly. I thought I had some time before I would get completely thrown into the fire, but that's fine. I like it here. First off, I'm putting back on a totem. I think I took it off because I literally had extra spots I should have put dirt in. Smart thinking. But anyway, we're not gonna spawn our chickens. We're not gonna use any of this stuff, really. All right, first things first, we have to make a livable area. I would love to go mining, but I can't place down any chests and everything in here is already taking up all of my storage. I can't worry about these guys anymore. Let's let's figure out what we're going to do. All right, with what we have, I'm thinking first things first, we need to make some sort of really really tiny air pocket down below, which is just right there basically. I have my tropical fish whose name is Jeff, I believe, but I am not going to take him down there. I don't want to lose him. So we're gonna make a new bucket of, of nothing and then hopefully create a livable gap in the water. Aha, this works. Okay, so um, let's build some sort of a ship, I think. Um, also, the sun's going down and that looks so cool. Oh my word, that is so cool. I really like that view, other than the fact that the sun's going down. We don't have to worry about mobs, I guess, technically, while we're here. So that's a good sign. But how do I build a boat? Okay, we're gonna grab slabs real quick, and that's pretty much it. I'd have, I have no inventory space. We are just gonna have to work with zero inventory space. That's fine, we'll do it. It's, it's gonna be okay. So we're gonna start off with just the really bad ship design that we all know and love. All right, this one's gonna be a little bit different than all of the other projects I've done because normally I put them in replay mod. This has to be a little bit smaller. I can't realistically build this in replay mod. I feel like it's not gonna look very good underwater. You're experiencing the video with me, okay? It's fine. Some of you guys don't actually understand this, but I don't really know what or how or where I'm going in between episodes. So <laughs> this is completely new to me and I don't really know how I'm going to survive here. Uh, the goal at the moment is, is just boat. And if I didn't have the threat of drowning 24 seven, this would be a lot easier. All right, this is half the shell. It's at least looking like a, like a, a boat. So that's, 
that's a good sign. We're getting somewhere. All right, and at the moment, this is our uh, our little hut ship thing. So first things first, I'm gonna figure out a way to drain the interior, and there we go. I just filled in every single block underneath here, and I hope that I can remember the pattern of this ship, because otherwise I'm gonna spill in more water and oh kind of like that okay this is <laughs> this is what we have to work with oh this is so bad i think i'm gonna keep torches on me and i have to make some sort of a doorway here okay that's our doorway i don't know how to get up to it actually i probably should have made it one lower but that is our door and this is our house what do you guys think i think we end the episode here all right cool all right no 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 i have to fix the outside of the ship but first i'm i'm storing some materials here okay i can't build with everything on me okay i fixed the entrance i think this right here is our best bet to get out into the into the world here and i think it should be like that boom okay cool so we have a double entrance just like this and now we're out but what we are gonna do is fix up the ship a little bit by adding in real wood and stuff which i don't think i'm gonna be able to show because of drowning so we'll just do it very quickly like this all right, exterior-wise, that looks really good. Um, we have the front of the ship. I don't really know the terminology for ships. And we have the back of the ship, which is a little bit shorter of a log situation. And then we have some fences and slabs. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm still working on the interior, but um, I have an idea that it drops down a little bit because I really need space in here. So we're gonna take a little bit of the seafloor out and add hopefully some nicer area. I, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with the gravel. I don't think I can use it for anything. I do like the texture of the andesite though. I might be able to do something with that. I just don't want it to be all spruce. All right, so let me give you my idea. We have our front door here. Um, I All right, I have no ideas, but this right here, I'm thinking mine shape because other than um, this, I can't really get down to anywhere. So we're going to make a mine shaft here. Uh, bed, maybe. I don't know. This is so tiny. I've never had to work with such a small space. I really like the challenge, but what in the heck am I supposed to do here? I highly doubt I'm going to be sleeping that much, so we should probably just go with uh, chests. Actually, when it comes to storage, I might be able to use barrels, like literally in the actual ship itself. I kind of... Ooh. All right. We're not doing too bad. I'm, I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. However, I'm running out of spruce fast, so I kind of have to just use the very limited amount that I have left to make some more barrels and maybe use one here for the base of this and uh, strip it, actually. Ooh, okay, I like that a lot more. Okay. All right, we're getting somewhere. We have some sort of small design. I'm liking it. We'll add a side barrel here, put the enchant table on top. I don't really have anything to add to up here. Oh boy. Let's put the nether portal somewhere in here. No, that's a bad idea. Okay, I'm actually just gonna store everything I have on me and go grab the chest that's still floating in the middle of the ocean up here. It's nighttime again? How long was I down there? You're laying eggs still. That doesn't seem sanitary, guys. I don't know if you know this or not, but you're just kind of salting your eggs, I guess. All right. Now that we've grabbed this stuff, we gotta go put it in our temporary home, which I'm kind of liking more than any of the other ones we've made. Don't ask me why, I, I really don't know. Then we'll put this stuff in here, specialty gear. Okay, we'll organize this later, but right now I have nothing else I really need to put down. We're not gonna make a kitchen in this place, cause where? So instead, I think the first thing we're gonna go do is mine right out the gate. And we did get books. But I don't really want to waste the wood that we do have on bookshelves. Maybe birch, but we'll see. So I think we need to make ourselves a mine shaft here. And um, I didn't think this through. Okay, this is all I can think to do right now, which is fine. It looks fine. We're just going to make our staircase downward now because I have no other way of, of getting below without just making this look meh. Oh, great, the ocean. I forgot this was here, actually. Was I in this cave before? I feel like I was. It's too, it's too shallow. Okay, we need... Wait, is there dirt in here? <gasps> okay, wait, we might actually be able to do stuff with that dirt. That is useful information to have. Okay, coal is the first ore we've gotten. We probably should get a lot deeper before I start actually caring about the ores, but hey, when you find um, a lemon, you make uh, orange juice. I think that's how that goes. And while I'm mining my way down to diamond level, I should probably let you know the goals of this video. The first goal I had was to build a livable house in the ocean, which I think I've already spoiled for y'all. Goal number two is going to be getting a level 30 enchant table. Now, I think we can already accomplish that with the materials we have, but doing it in an ocean is a different story. And last but not least, of course, I am going to attempt to take on the guardian temple. The giant white pufferfish are mine. 
mine. Aha, we've arrived. Ooh, a lush cave. All right, that's, well, food. I, I don't really need it right now, but we have some food. That's good. Is there anything over? Diamonds, let's go. And it's one. How disappointing. Actually, this is Minecraft now. I expect it. However, I did see some gold right here, which I will grab every ore is useful okay i don't have very long where i'm at and depending on where i am located i don't know how much time i'll have in the mines this episode i feel like i'll have quite a bit of time here but to get to the real diamond level i have to descend a little bit further all right we're at diamond level and uh there's not a single cave in the immediate future but that's fine because we can strip mine i don't mind strip mining i doubt we'll see the border have you seen how large that circle was all right i don't i don't think we'll see the border anytime soon all right so strip mining is not working and i'm i'm now getting a little bit worried about where the border is i feel like i only mined 50 blocks but who knows where that thing is so we're gonna go back up to this lush cave area i did find just a second ago and i feel like i missed something actually i know i missed something because i saw this right here Aha. Ha! Is there more to this cave? I feel like it's just an upward area, but hey, iron's here, I guess. Um, okay. Well, this was a absolute bust. Wait. <gasps> it's not. Okay. Wait, there's more. All right. Now I'm just gonna explore these caves. Make sure I don't miss any diamonds, okay? I really want to have a lot of diamonds before I leave this place, or at least like four, because that's a lot nowadays is, is four, because you can't find them anywhere, apparently. Holy cow, this thing goes on forever. I hope, actually, because I I really need to find diamonds. And oh, diamond, what perfect timing. I don't understand how that happened, but it's only, oh, it's two this time. Okay. That's not that bad. That's good. That's progress. We're finding two at a time now. Hopefully we find three in the next vein. That'd be awesome. Ooh, wait, is this one of those iron things? There's a raw iron block here. Okay, this is so much iron. I can already tell I'm gonna be here for like 20 minutes mining all of this iron. I just fell in another hole. Um, and there's more iron. This does not end. I don't think this is ever gonna end. I feel like I'm gonna walk out of here with locks of iron. I don't understand what's going on. But after mining all of the visible iron in this location, uh, we have way over a stack, and I, I don't think I need any more right now. I do want more diamonds, though, so I think we need to go deeper. Oh, I missed one. Okay, so I just mined down randomly because I hear water, and I found diamonds. Um, I swear. Look, no, I heard the water. It was right here. See? All right, water. Okay, I, I'm not cheating. That was really lucky though well new cave in a second after i grab this redstone all right now this cave has to be blessed right there's got to be more diamonds in here is this a ravine um kind of what is this place more tropical fish i love these things but i really don't want to take them from their totally natural habitat except this blue one he's cool all right friend i'm gonna need you to guide me to the diamonds all right you're my blue fish blue diamonds i, I think i see a correlation there oh my word he actually did find me diamonds two different veins of them okay this fish is awesome i love him i'm gonna let you guys guys actually named this one. I, I named the other everything, so you guys got this one. He did find us six diamonds, though, without even trying, so maybe something cool? That'd be good. Just comment below, and I'll pick one that's really, really good, and, and maybe pin it, so yeah, be creative, please. Look at this guy go! Another one already! Holy cow! We might actually walk out of here with, like, 20 extra diamonds, which is good, because my armor is not looking it. All right, fishy, I don't know if I, uh, if I want to be down here much longer. Please find me one more vein of, yes, diamonds. Okay, cool. Is it one? Are you serious? I, I might just leave you here. Honestly, uh, one, one diamond. We're okay. We're at 15. That's fine. Ooh, we, okay. It's a skeleton one. I don't really like the skeleton ones. Um, they give me bone meal, but at the same time, they kind of hurt like a lot. So we're going to instantly break that. Thank you very much. Please. Uh, that's not exactly what I wanted. Please. Oh boy. Um, pumpkin seeds. I feel like I have a pumpkin. Do I not have a pumpkin? We'll take it home just in case. And that's, uh, okay. I guess this one. Have I listened to this one before? I might need to make a jukebox, actually. I've never heard that one, I think. Anyway, I'm going to the surface. Oh, the surface. I see it. Oh, hey, wait a minute. What is this all about? You have anything good? Absolutely not. Wait, silk touch? Uh, that could actually be useful in some capacity if I'm not going to drown here for a second. And that gold block I kind of want. Oh, there's two. Give me these. All right. Anyway, we're getting back up to the surface. And where's our home at? Ah, chickens and that thing. We have got to stay away from that. I see the thing. Look at it. Okay, so there's one there, one there, and most likely one right there. We know where all three of them are located. 
so we might be able to take that on very soon. Hello, Boathouse. I'm very glad to see you. All right, I've, I would like to breathe some fresh recycled oxygen. Perfect. I have no idea where this actually leads anymore because, um, yeah, I was not able to find that again. But here we are. We're back in the Boathouse. We're doing good. We have 38 diamonds that is amazing and we do need to make some more furnaces actually that was what we're missing in the house i'm assuming right there is probably uh, the best location maybe there as well and we'll add a trap door for effect cool anyway we're gonna put all of this stuff away and then take the stuff that we need to smelt and put it in the furnaces Cool. All right, while that smelts, I honestly think we need to prepare for this, um, the guardian temple thing over that way, because I, I honestly don't know how I'm going to take it out. I really, really want to, so we're probably going to need all five of these totems. We should definitely make a ton of doors, okay? These are 24. That's not enough. We're using all of the birch on the doors, okay? This is a big deal, people. However, the other thing I did want to quickly make is the level 30 enchant table. Now, I think I really want it on a pickaxe, but we might be getting a better sword enchant at the same time, so I kind of want to do the sword or the pickaxe because if we're taking on this temple i'm kind of scared of the temple part so we might actually need a better sword um fun fact i had to go down here because um there is no room in the ship there's no way i am fitting an enchantment table and all of these bookshelves up there so we're just gonna stuff them down here for now and hope that we get a really nice uh, silk touch enchant, maybe? So we don't have to mine these later? That'd be cool, actually. That'd probably be the best of, of every world. So, boom. There we go. Okay, we're gonna make a pickaxe, and then I'm assuming we'll just stick with a sword. One of these two things have to have a good enchant, right? They can't both be absolutely terrible, or at least um, my luck isn't that bad, probably. Unbreaking three. Okay, and this smite four. What am I supposed to do with smite? We're testing this. Ah, uh, wow, that's terrible. But we test knockback two. No, right, sharpness three, knockback two. That is not a bad setup. I won't lie, that's not a bad setup. We still have one more enchant we can use this on, and I think we risk it on a helmet. The reason being, I can get aqua affinity or respiration right now. Both both of them would be amazing. And if I can get respiration, I, I don't actually think I need to worry about the door situation. That's not what I want to see. Fire protection? Really? Ah, uh, whatever. Aqua affinity. Okay, that's not as bad as you might think. Aqua affinity with unbreaking is totally fine by me. We can now break blocks a little bit quicker while underwater, meaning we can escape if we don't have mining fatigue. I'm fine with this. We actually might be able to do this. I have very little hope, which is why we're actually in, um, you know, survival and not hardcore, but we could do this. We could do this. The only other thing I think I'm going to do is I'm going to take these apples. I'm going to take this gold that we have, and I'm going to make golden apples. This is the best thing I could possibly do with this gold right now. There's nothing else I need this for other than this. Oh my word. I think, I think we're ready. All right, please break. Please be able to break. No, we're not able to break in. All right, if we can't break in, we got to go the old fashioned way, boys. Got to go straight down here and breathe. All right, I'm going to go this way first. I know where I'm going, and by no, I mean absolutely not have a clue where I'm going right now. Okay, still haven't been able to find this guy anywhere, which is a little bit of an issue, but I think we're dialing in on the location somewhere. The normal issue I'm having right now is, is drowning. Um, it seems to be a big one that kind of happens a lot. Where is this... Is there a big guy anywhere? Seriously? Wait, I think I see his tail. That's gotta be him right there. Okay, how do I get to him? Wait, is this it? This has to be it. We're gonna pop a golden apple. He's gotta be right in this hole. This is exactly where he is, right? Yes, he's in the hole. We're gonna take him on. I am taking major damage from this guy. Holy cow. Okay, how much health do they have? Please die soon. Yes, we got him and we got a sponge. I don't know if that's useful to me, but I mean, it kind of is. I'm in an ocean, so... It makes sense to have a, a sponge. How many? Just a singular sponge. That's fine. We took out one. One of three <laughs> that are in here. All right, I think I'm in a new area. Oh, I'm definitely in a new area. Holy cow, I shouldn't go in there. There's a lot of guys in there. I noticed if I hide behind doors, they like stop trying to laser me though. So that's always good. I can just kind of put one there and they're like, what's going on? Okay, seriously, where are these guys? I actually have no idea. I cannot find them. I think the only way I'm gonna be able to find these guys if I go through the gold room. Not the best idea. We are shockingly running out of doors. Um, my boots are breaking. 
Everything is going wrong. I cannot find these guys anywhere. Oh, hello. I found one. Okay. Wait a minute. I found one. I found one. I found one. Hello. Come here. You're already low. I can tell. Oh, you stopped me. Oh, that's not good. There goes my absorption. Please die. Yes. Another sponge door. Yes. Okay, there's two down. I don't know. I think this is the top, right? And I've only ever seen two in this place. Did I actually take it out? Did we get it? Is there another one? I won't know for like another three minutes because then I'll get more mining fatigue. But if I don't, then we did it. In case the mining fatigue does eventually go away, I'm going to sit right here and just break the prismarine and, and hope I get to the gold that I know is inside this thing. All right. I just got mining fatigue again, meaning there's still one more in here somewhere and I have to go find him. I'll be back. I have no idea where this guy is. This is getting to... Oh! Okay, all right. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We gotta gapple up. This is our third one. This is our third one, baby. We hide here. Wait, wait, wait. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. We, we block him off with the doors? We block him off with the doors? He has no idea. We're door blocking. He has no idea. He can't hit me. He can't, he can't touch me. He can't hit me with the beam. I'm beaming him. He's gonna die. He's so dead. Yes! We got him. That's the last one. I actually do need a door now. Thank you very much. Oh, we did it. We cleared all three of them. Now we just have to wait for three minutes for this mining fatigue to wear away. Oh, that's lovely. Okay. I'm going to go back to trying to mine that gold, I guess. Yes, with the mining fatigue. Oh, my word. There's so many in here. With the mining fatigue cleared, though, I can go in here and grab this gold, which is just free for me. <laughs> now to just find those sponges from earlier. I think if we go up here, um, this way, and then right up here. Please, 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 please. Yes, sponges. And the last of the sponges. 38 wet sponge. All right, that's actually not bad. Would you guys believe me if I told you I had actually never been in one of these things before uh, or defeated it? I've actually never done that. We didn't even use a totem. Holy cow, I thought we were going to use a totem in there. I thought we were going to use all of them, to be honest, but I survived. But we're going down to the house, and we are going to count our rewards. All right, obviously we got eight more blocks of gold, which is really good because we just made a ton of golden apples. I believe the iron's most likely smelted. Perfect. Okay, yeah, we don't have that much time left. Um, Oh, boy, we're going to have to do the whole boat chest thing again and grab our chickens on the way up. So let's decide what we want to keep and what we need to stay. Day. We gotta take both of our fishies. Oh my word, I have to go back through everything. Oh, this is not good. The enchantment table. Oh, I gotta take that. But wait, where is that? Where is... Yes, the soak touch shovel. This is exactly why I grabbed the soak touch shovel from the nether portal. Because now I can just break these and pick them all up. Boom. That is the entire enchantment table collected with a literal gold shovel. Probably the best investment I've ever had. Okay, so other than the obvious stuff, we have diamond things. Um, the, those things are definitely needed, but uh, these two, the eggs. Okay, I'm gonna go put what I can in the chest up top and see how much room we have left. I know I'm gonna be fighting for inventory space this time. We got sponges, all right? Those are new. Let's put the totems up there. We'll do the extra armor pieces, the enchant table. Literally everything right here is going with us, okay? It does not matter. All of that is going. Oh, that's a lot of inventory space for so little items. And once we grab this last sponge, we should have everything we need from the boathouse. Okay, I've really liked living here. I, I enjoyed building it. This is really cute. I kind of want to put this in a world that I'm totally making. All right. Hello, Mr. Chickens. Is there anything I can also stack in here? I don't believe so. Uh, man. Okay, okay, okay. We're going to throw the planks down. We're going to grab up all of our leads that are floating to the bottom of the ocean. Grab our chickens, because the leads don't count as items. The block's back, and we're in our boat again. Okay, cool. Boys, I know you weren't used in the ocean, but I pray that we're going to go somewhere where you can be used. Hopefully land. That would be great. And it's time to teleport in three, two, one. Oh, what the? This is completely illogical. But it also solves all of my problems. 